Taj Mahdar ordered the internal investigation into this arrest. It was caught on camera Sunday at 30th and Ellison. That's in North Omaha, not far from Miller Park. KETV News Watch 7's Michelle Bandor spoke to the mother of the woman being arrested, and she joins us live. Alexandra and Rob, Phyllis Holling says her 40-year-old daughter has special needs, is homeless, and has been arrested several times for trespassing. She questions why the officers didn't call in the mental health trained officer to assist. And the woman who recorded the arrest on her cell phone tells me the crime doesn't matter. She believes the officer went too far. This is totally uncalled for right here. Look at him stuffing my daughter. Phyllis Hollings wants answers. My daughter was already handcuffed. Hollings says her 40 year old daughter, Jennifer Carter, is the barefoot woman in the cell phone video under arrest and put into a police cruiser Sunday at 30th and Ellison. My daughter, she's been in special education from kindergarten. Then she graduated from North in special education also. I see three police officers throw this lady down. Stephanie Goodwin didn't like what she saw while driving on 30th Street and did a U-turn to get a closer look. And just took my phone out and started recording because they were using way excessive force. Hey, sir! The two officers are getting her in. The other guy's just standing there kicking her. Um, her foot comes out, he stomps on it and like tries to break her ankle. Um, they're hoping it just get shoved up under the rug. Thank God Stephanie knew to turn around. You want a ticket for obstructing traffic? No, sir. But you need to stop kicking on that female like that. Sheila likely was following her friend and witnessed the arrest. She says it makes her angry since she lost a cousin to police force. It's not that we're trying to trash our police department no. because I thank God for them. We're just trying to make awareness that these kind of things still go on. In a statement, Omaha police say the chief is aware of the video circulating on social media and adding he authorized that internal investigation. I want them held accountable for what they did to my child. Go. Yeah, I do. And I got you on record too. Good luck. Well, police haven't released the report of the arrest, saying it is in the still in the preliminary status. Now, jail records show police booked Carter for trespassing, disorderly conduct, drug possession, and resisting arrest. Her mother says she hasn't been able to see her daughter while she's in jail.